Dear students of class 5, I am Mrs. Neha Makkar and today we will revise the topic adjectives. Adjectives are nothing but describing words. They qualify or in other words give more information about a noun or a pronoun. Adjective is of different kinds. They tell us about the quality, quantity, number, order or degree of the noun or pronoun. Let us see all these types in detail. Words that tell us more about the nouns are called adjectives and hence they are also known as describing words. Adjectives give us more information about the nouns such as the shape, size, color, age, number, quantity, taste, how something feels, the order or the position of something and sometimes even to show a position or belonging. Circular track, small house. So the word circular here, children is telling us about the shape. Small is telling us about the size. Red apples, red is telling about the color of the apples. Then Eight bananas, it is telling about how many bananas were there. Sweet mango, what kind of mango was there. Third, again it tells the rank or the position. Seven years old, so the age. Some oil, the quantity. Soft cloth, the quality or the kind of cloth it was. My company, it is showing the belonging or the possession that this particular company is of that particular person. Now children, apart from the quality, quantity that is there, there are some kind of adjectives in which we question also. Hence, they are known as interrogative adjectives because we question here. What and which are the adjectives in which we question when they modify a noun. That is, they limit the sense in which a noun is used. What and which are interrogative examples? Let us see the example. What paper is this? Which house is yours? So, what and which? They are asking questions here. And these adjectives can also be used in an exclamatory sense. Exclamatory sense, children, to express a sudden emotion or Feeling like for example, what a beautiful place, what nonsense. So, these adjectives are telling us about the strong feeling about the beautiful place or if you are feeling that something wrong has happened, some nonsense has happened. And the adjectives are also used to highlight the belonging, the possession that this particular thing belongs to me or belongs to some other person. I want my own room. So the adjective my is showing the possession or the belonging of the room. The adjective very is also used to highlight something. For example, this is the very place he fell. So they are highlighting that that was the place that person fell. Children, there is one more kind of adjective which is known as a demonstrative adjective. Why we call it as demonstrative? Because it is used to pinpoint a particular thing or a noun. So, like for example, this boy is a nice boy or this boy was standing in the corridor. That girl was sitting in the class. So, this and that are pointing towards that particular girl or that particular boy. So, this and that are also a kind of adjective. They are known as demonstrative adjectives because we pinpoint towards a particular name, place, animal or thing. So, let us see what an adjective tells us about. It tells us about a person, a place, an animal, or a thing. So basically they describe a noun and sometimes even pronoun. 
So the adjective answers the question what kind. Up till now whatever examples we have seen so they tell us what kind of person that was what color that person was wearing so it answers the question what kind. So the small boy is walking. So now you ask the question what kind of boy he is. He is a small boy. So the adjective here is small. Let us have a look at the other example. This is a big farm. So what kind of farm it is? It's a big farm. It's answering the question what kind. Now the next example. The brown cow was on the farm. So it is telling us about the color of the cow that is brown. This is a funny book. So what kind of book it is? It's a funny book. Some adjectives tell us about the colors. Like we have seen in the previous examples also. Red apples. Okay. So and sometimes color and sometimes even the shape of the particular thing. So as you can see in the picture. Did you see the grey kitten? Yes. So it is telling us about the color grey. Now can you see the strawberries in the basket? I love red strawberries. Again it is telling us about the color red of the strawberries. The next example. Did you see my yellow duck? So again it is telling us about the color yellow of the noun duck. The next example. The round sun is in the sky. So what kind of sun it is? It's a round sun. So it is telling us about the shape of the sun, shape of the noun. The next example. The food is in a square bag. So it is telling us about the shape of the noun bag which is square. Some adjectives tell us about the size also. Okay. So whether it's too short, too long. So let us see the example. So this is a small bunny. So how is the bunny or how is the rabbit? It is very small. So small is the adjective here. It is here telling us about the size of the bunny. The next example. Dinosaur has a short neck. So the adjective here is short. It is telling us about the size of the dinosaur's neck. Dinosaur has big legs but it is having big legs. So it is telling us about the size of the legs of the dinosaur. Dinosaur has a long tail. So again it is telling us about the size of the tail of the dinosaur. That is long. Dinosaur has a huge head. So again huge is telling us about the size of the dinosaur's head. Now children let us solve a practice worksheet. Here we may have more than one answer also out of the three options. My dad has a dash car. So here children it is blue in color. So blue is also the right answer and it is small in size also. So both answers are correct blue car or small car. Amy has a dash dog. So small chair friendly. So again as you can see the size it is small and Dogs are generally tend to be friendly with their masters. So the correct answer is Amy has a small dog or Amy has a friendly dog. Ella plays with a sleep red big ball. So again the ball is red in color. So red is also the correct answer. And it is big in size. So big can also be the answer. So Ella plays with a Red ball or Ella plays with a big ball. Pete wants a red pen 
fast bicycle so it is red in color as it is shown in the picture so red is the suitable adjective here and a bicycle is also fast by nature so the correct adjectives are pete wants a red bicycle or he pete wants a fast bicycle anna found a bag beautiful pink flan so bag is nowhere coming in the picture it is looking beautiful also and it is pink in color so the correct adjectives are beautiful and pink anna found a beautiful flan anna found a pink flan dad has three big black shoes so three is nowhere coming in the picture the shoes are black also and they are big also so dad has big shoes or dad has black shoes laila wears a yellow long table dress so it is long also and it is yellow in color also it is telling us about the size that is long and it is also telling us about the color which is yellow so both the adjectives are correct laila wears a long dress or a yellow dress emma has a book bird sad face so as you can see that she is crying so sad face is right and that is the only correct option that is there so emma has a sad face lucas has a bus long bear letter as you can see in the picture the letter is very long in size so the correct answer is lucas has a long letter grandma has a purple pretty horse umbrella so it is purple in color also as shown in the picture and it is pretty also it's beautiful also so grandma has a purple umbrella or grandma has a pretty umbrella both the answers are right josh has a box colorful stripy hat so as you can see stripes are there on the hat so josh has a stripy hat and joy josh has a colorful hat both the answers are correct nick likes bottle big house cake so the correct answer is only big here because it's a big it's a huge cake nick likes big cakes so that is the correct answer thank you students